What's up gamers, my name is Luco, and in this league, as well as the past several leagues, I've been hearing a disturbing amount of people slandering the breach mechanic, and I'm tired of pretending they're right. Sure, you don't get a whole lot of splinters from the monsters you kill, and it's super annoying that we still have to pick them up one by one, but that's not really the point now, is it? Exiles, I pose to you a question. Why do we play Path of Exile long after we've killed all the pinnacle bosses, after we've cleared 40 out of 40 challenges, and after we've bought our headhunters, magebloods, and nemeses? Why do we keep upgrading and upgrading our gear with layer after layer of modifiers, influences, and corruptions? The answer is simple. Pure, unadulterated violence. We play to kill more monsters, and more monsters, and more, yeah, more monsters. So how, I ask, do we kill the absolute most monsters? There's only one answer, and it's Breach. No other league mechanic allows you to shove so many monsters into a single bright purple and red circle, or any kind of shape for that matter. No other league mechanic has even half as many monsters as Breach does, except maybe Blight, but unlike Blight, Breach is actually fun. So each individual Breach has bazillions of monsters in it, and for a couple leagues in a row now, GGG has been allowing us to shove more and more Breaches into our maps. In Necropolis League, GGG reworked the entire Scarab system and allowed us to use 4 Breach Scarabs to guarantee 8 Breaches on every single map. In Settlers of Calgary League, we were blessed even further when the devs added a 6th slot to the map device and allowed us to add up to 5 Breach Scarabs, guaranteeing a minimum of 10 Breaches every map. If you add in the Breach Craft on the map device, that gives us 13 Breaches guaranteed every single map. On top of that, there's also the Eve of Invasion node on the Atlas Tree, which, if we get lucky, can bring us all the way up to 23 Breaches in a single map. It's not a great chance, but it's still there. So that's anywhere from 13 to 23 instances of the highest monster density you can find anywhere in PoE, and you can even open up multiple breaches at the same time, smooshing monsters into every little nook and cranny that can hold them. Not only do breaches have the thickiest monster packs of any league mechanic in the game, but those monsters also look cool as hell. The purple and red fire aesthetic is, hands down, <laughs> uh, the coolest there is. So we get the most monsters ever, and we also get the coolest monsters ever. It's literally an unbeatable combination, and I don't understand how anyone can feel otherwise. So if you're a breach hater, I hope this video helps you understand the error of your ways. If you haven't messed around with Breach too much, I hope this video encourages you to try it out. Lastly, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to smash the like button, subscribe for more, and I'll see you in another video.